Greetings YouTube, welcome to Earth42 channel. This new story is on days may have 25, 25 hours in near future due to Earth's declaring rotation. And here it goes. Days are gradually growing longer. <clears throat> to the layman, this means that in the northern hemisphere, days are longer in summer than they are in winter. But geoscientists interpret this pause as following the found that days grow longer, now means springtime. The reason for that is the moon. First and foremost, its gravity creates permanent waves and oceans, and the Earth's depths through our planet seems to waver, the German newspaper wrote. Earth resembles a rotating figure skater to slow rotation down. A figure skater stretches his or her arms out. That is why in the far future there will be 25 hours in a day. A bit of astronomer managed to prove that Earth's rotation had been slowing down since 700 BC. The, Earth, the scientists study clay plates and other historical writings that continue information about solar and lunar eclipse. He used the information to calculate Earth's breaking path. When prehistoric photo animals inhabited Earth 530 million years ago, there were 21 hours in a day. For dinosaurs who lived 100 million years ago, days altered each other 23 hours. This can be clearly seen by sedimentic of coral. Chorus. Chorus seems to mark the calendar and annually form new sediments, the thickness of reeds depending on the season. By the means of scientists calculated the time scale between springs, this period has been slowly slowing down throughout history. About 500, 530 million years ago, Earth's rotation on its axis faster than it does today, but it rotated about the sun at steady speed. At that time, the year had the same amount of hours it has today, but there were 420 days in it. According to trustworthy sources throughout the history of mankind, Earth's rotation has been producing its speed. Richard Stanford from Durham University, UK, says for the journalist for the history of astronomy. Stephenson based his conclusion on descriptions of hundreds of solar and lunar eclipses during the last 2,700 years. Clay plates of Free Christian Babylon which is Iraq, modern day, substance the slowdown in the Earth's rotation best of all. Stephenson wrote, Babylonian scientists used come from characteristics to record the exact place and time of solistic Earth's events. Moreover, Stephenson studied documents of the Chinese, European origin. Once in about 300 years, people can observe the total solar eclipse from anywhere. When the moon takes place between the sun and Earth, Total darkness occurs for several minutes. As often as not, they notice the exact day and time of the beginning and the end of the solar eclipse. The information was enough for the astronomer to determine the exact position of the sun, as it was thousands of years ago. The tables for recalculating dates of the Babylonian calendar came in handy. Astronomical observers use the date about the position of the sun in historical writings to restore the picture of the planet's slowdown. Since the trajectory of Earth's rotation about the sun is not connected with Earth's rotation's axis, astronomers calculated the independent time scale, the so-called terror time TT, and, and slow, slow down in the Earth's rotation. It seems if we compare the TT with the universal time, UT. UT is the general time based on rotation of the Earth, and it is determined by the sun position, regarded by Greenwich's main time, GMT. Greenwich is a British city. It is necessary to set this time backward for several years between the end of the Earth and the beginning of the other three, other, th other there in one space second. Excuse me. Richard Stephenson used historical writings to determine his coloration between two times. The difference between UT and TT depends on long 
ago, an eclipse took place. Through overweight millennium, a day grows longer by two thousandths of a second. The measurement made by satellites proved the slowdown. It turns out that in the prime of Babel, a day was shorter by four hundredths of seconds. Nevertheless, Stephen Sun managed to determine this any abnormality due to the mistake in u universal time. Since 700 BC, about a million days have passed since that was sold in today. Three, th th through, we would have to set the clock with seven hours to be the time in 700 BC. The last years made it expectant. During this time, the day almost did not grow longer the Earth rotated almost at a steady speed. The shift of masses in the Earth might speed up the Earth's rotation and make up the slowdown caused by the Moon. The terrible earthquake in Saturn, Asia, and Tevismir afterwards quickened the Earth's rotation in late 2004, which sort of in the day about 8 millions of seconds. According to the Tassel Earth's Rotation and Reference System Service, sort of term I IERS July 13, 2003 was the shortest day with, within the last 100 years. This day was sorted in an average 24 hour day by 1.5 thousandths of seconds. Once more, July 13, 2003 was the shortest day within the last 100 years of human history. This day was sorted in an average 24 hour day by 1.5 thousandths of seconds. Thank you for listening to me. Uh, I got this information from Pravda.ru. It's a great news agency. Thank you. Bye.